Hi everyone. Welcome or welcome back to our channel. This is the second video of our SQL series. As you know, in last video we were discussing more about data definition language. If you have missed to check out that video, please check the link in the description. So in, in this video, we'll be checking about data manipulation language. This language has three basic commands. As you can see in the screen, it's insert, update, and delete. As the name indicates, insert command is used to insert the data into the table. Update is used to modify the existing data into, from the table and delete is used to delete the records from the table. Now we will check the syntax of these commands. So as we saw in the last video, the way how we can create the table and we have created a table known as persons. So in the last video, we have created the table person. As of now, we ha don't have any records in the this table. Now we'll be using insert command to insert the record into the table. So for that, we'll be writing insert into persons values. Person ID should be integer. So let's suppose ID is one. Person first name, let's suppose is know how and the person last name is language now as you can see the second and third were pair care we'll have to use this particular syntax to enter data okay and you can execute this command this should uh, Insert a record into the table as you can see the row is inserted. Now, if you'll use this select command, you'll be seeing the record. Now, the second command is update command. So, to execute uh, update command, we'll consider a scenario where we want to change the first name of a person whose person ID is 1. Okay, so we'll be writing the query as update table name as persons set first name and I suppose I want to write ABC where person ID S1 okay now they should update our record and as it can it's you can see it says a row has been updated. We'll check the table data. You can see it is updated. Now the, the third command is pretty simple. It is delete record. So we'll have to write delete. Let's, uh, there are two scenarios where, uh, how we can delete. For our case, we have one record in the table. Let's suppose you have multiple records in the table. Okay. So, let's I'm entering one more record, okay. Now you can see we have two records, okay. So there can be a case where you want to delete one particular record. So in that case, we can write delete persons where person ID is equal to two. Here I'm trying to delete the record of the person whose ID is 2. Okay, so it, you can see one row is deleted. Now, you, you, let's suppose you want to execute a scenario where you want to delete the entire uh, table records. Okay, so you can simply write delete persons. See, your two rows is deleted. Now, if you'll check the select command you won't have any data into the table so that is all about these three commands let me know if you have any feedback for me in comment section i will meet in the next video till then bye bye